I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw herbivores that are animals. So up here in the corner I'm just going to write herbivores which is a fancy way of saying animals that only eat plants. So I'm going to put down here plant eaters. And you can tell from their teeth if you ever looked in the side of their mouth they have flat teeth. We're going to start out on the bottom and we're going to draw some of the things that they eat. So start right here on the bottom left Put a dot and just draw a curve line up, connect. Put a dot, curve line up, connect. Put a dot, curve line up, connect. And next to it, let's just put some little baby circles. Because, we can even put some dots inside. One of the things they eat are nuts and seeds. Right next to it, we're going to draw a curve line up, down, curve line up, down, curve line out, down, curve line up, down, curve line up, down. In between, we're going to draw a straight line, straight line, straight line, straight line. Come back to the first one and just draw little straight lines up on the left, little straight lines on the right. Little straight lines up on the left, little straight lines on the right. Little straight, whoops, lines on the left, little straight lines on the right, little straight lines on the left, little straight lines on the right. They eat grass and they eat greens. Okay, next to that put a dot. Curve line out, in, out, come back to the dot, curve line out, in, up, connect, straight line, straight line, straight line, curve line up, curve line down, connect. Right behind it, draw one, two, three curved lines and put a dot, one, two, three in each one. Next to that, let's put a curved line. Big curve line up, big curve line back, connect, little straight lines inside, straight line, curve line, straight line, curve line for a carrot. Next to that, let's just put straight line, straight line, curve up, curve up, baby circle, baby circle, baby circle, baby circle, baby circle, all the way down. Next to that, let's just do one more curve line, crashes in, jump over, curve line out, in, connect, straight line, straight line, straight line, curve line up. So, they also eat fruits and vegetables. Now, come all the way over, and we're just going to draw curve lines all the way, slightly curved lines all the way down, keep going, and put a little baby circle at the top. And this is going to be our hay. You can even put another one inside. So it looks more like a bushel of hay. Little knobs at the top. Little baby circles. Okay. Now, who eats these things? Starting over here on the left, we are going to draw a row of animals that are herbivores. So starting right here, put a dot. And let's draw a curve line up, curve line over, connect. On the left, we're going to draw a little curve line, zigzag, curve line, zigzag, connect. We're just going to put a big curve line up and around. Little curve line, little curve line, triangle on top. Just put little curve lines going all the way around. Dot, dot straight line. Tortoises, turtles, they eat, they are herbivores. Right next to that, put a dot, curve line in, down, around, come back to the dot, curve line out, in, connect, 
we're going to put a straight line curve line connect curve line curve line connect straight diagonal curve line straight diagonal curve line let's put a curve line inside and a little curve line down below straight line straight line dot dot wavy line down wavy line up cows are herbivores okay right next to that we're putting a dot big curve line down floating big curve line out down connect come inside we're going to draw a curve line curve line dot dot come down below teardrop teardrop smile little curve line on the right little curve line on the left come up above let's draw that line again color this in yes gorillas are herbivores come right up above put a dot straight diagonal down curve line straight diagonal up come back to the top straight line straight line little curve line straight line straight line now curve line curve line curve line down curve line curve line curve line up dot dot little curve line straight line straight line little curve line up horses are herbivores okay now put a dot over here and let's just draw curve line over connect big curve line on the left big curve line on the right little curve line on the left little curve line on the right right here in the center put a dot and we're just going to draw a flat oval going up and down dot dot and let's color this in that's his nose koalas are herbivores and last but not least put a dot right there and we're just going to draw a curve line curve line curve line out curve line curve line up come back over here on the top curve line down big curve line come back over here on the inside we're going to just draw a little straight line straight line up straight line out down curve line dot dot elephants are herbivores okay now besides also eating grains fruits seeds nuts come over here doesn't matter if you crash into your drawing straight diagonal then a V straight diagonal all the way down keep going jump over because this is important curve line curve line curve line on the left curve line curve line curve line on the right and inside we need to put all of these curve line connect curve line connect leaves because herbivores also are heavily into eating leaves off of trees okay let's see how we're going to color this in okay the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna color my nuts brown and I'm gonna color my seeds yellow this is a very important part of a diet for an herbivore then I'm going to do my grains I'm just gonna draw a yellow line through my grain jump over now I'm gonna do curved lines slightly curved lines for my hay and we'll talk about ecosystems in another video but this is what happens when any one part of the food chain gets goofed up because of whatever it can mess up the animals now I'm taking orange and I'm going to do my fruit right here I'm going to do my carrot right here I'm going to take my red for my apples right here and here we'll do some purple grapes right here 
all the way down. We're going to take some dark green for my leaves on my carrot and my apple and my grapes. Come back and get my brown, do my stems. Those are my fruits and vegetables. Now I'm going to come up and I'm going to do my tortoise. This is his shell. We'll make that brown. He's got a cute face, so I'm going to use my light green for his feet, his face, and his tail. Here's my cow. I'm just going to do her ears black. On my finished drawing, I did her horns black. Big mistake. So we won't make you do it. Then if I if you got pink, I did her muzzle pink. And since I have that out, I will do my horse pink. Now, if you have gray, you can do your gorilla. And you can do your koala. And you can do your elephant. If you don't have gray, you can use a light brown or a light black. Okay? On my horse, I'm going to do a black mane and get my brown out, do my ears brown, my face brown. Okay? Now, my tree. This is important because a lot of herbivores eat a lot of leaves and they get, they just reach up and get them off the trees to show I'm going to do a light green for the leaves and then I'm going to do a darker green around all the leaves now on this project I'm not going to label everything you should be able to look at it and go okay gorillas are herbivores you should be able to look at it and go, oh, okay, herbivores can eat seeds and grains. So we're just going to leave it like that. Okay, let's see what this, oops, I forgot my grass. Hello. Light green down here. This is also a very important plant for them to eat. Got to have grass. And like I said, we'll talk about ecosystems uh, once we get done with this. Okay, let's see what this looks like all colored in. Here are my herbivores all colored in. They are animals that are plant eaters. Okay, bye-bye.